What's going on, everybody? It's Nick Payne with Face Mask Fantasy. I'm here to help out with some week eight start considerations in case you're between a few options, a few players. So let's get right into it. First up, the Denver Broncos. Just the Broncos in general. Simply put, this matchup is beautiful. Denver's coming off a tough loss, but with 10 days rest. They have a great opportunity to right the ship against a struggling Washington team that, depending on where you look, is giving up the most or second most fantasy points both to quarterbacks and wide receivers this year. Teddy Bridgewater is on the streaming radar for anyone needing a quarterback week eight, and Cortland Sutton is my week eight start of the week. The matchup is excellent. Sutton still operates as the number one receiver in Jerry Judy's first game back from injury. He's an easy call to keep into your lineups despite some up and down weeks. Speaking of Judy, he's a dart throw having just returned, but if you're desperate, you couldn't ask for a better matchup for him coming back. He's on the wide receiver three-ish wide receiver four border with with a little bit of upside given the matchup. Washington is middle of the pack against running backs and tight ends, but both Melvin Gordon and Javante Williams are absolutely good flex plays this week, and Noah Fant is still a no-brainer for the majority of fantasy lineups. Brandon McManus is also a perfectly safe play at kicker, and the Broncos' defense is an easy start if you already had them rostered. 